Loans can be used to further your business. Loans are an important part of agriculture. Okay, there's three types of loans, short-term capital loans and mortgage loans. Short-term loans are scheduled to be repaid in less than a year. These are, crop loans are considered short-term loans. Okay, a crop loan, a lot of farmers in this area will go to Farm Credit Mid-South or a bank and they will borrow the money needed to put in the crop in the spring. Okay, they'll, buy, they'll borrow enough money to buy the seed, the fertilizer, to buy the diesel, uh, buy new equipment, and then they will farm all summer and interest will be collecting on that money. And then in the fall, whenever they harvest the crop, then they will pay the loan back plus interest. Mm -hmm. okay. That's how these lending companies make their money. They make their money by charging interest. Um, capital loans. Okay. You, businesses can borrow money in, in the form of a capital loan. Capital with a AL means money. Capital with an OL means like a place, like a city. Okay. Capital loans is the difference between purchase price and the sale price of an asset when the asset was sold for less than what it was bought. So if Cadence is having to sell her, uh, oh. she's having to sell her horses that she raised, her new foal crop, okay, she's breeding horses, she's selling the, the little ones. If she has to sell them for cheaper than what it costs her to produce those, she can get a capital loan for the difference until the market gets better and then she can start making money again. Kind of floating you along in your business to keep you from going out of business. Okay. Mortgage loans are real estate loans. A loan on real estate that is usually secured by a mortgage, okay? I would say probably most of your parents have a mortgage on their house, okay? A mortgage on your house, it's a long-term deal. A mortgage secured by collateral. What is collateral? They can take your house. Yeah, so when you do a mortgage loan, your house is collateral. Okay, if you don't pay that back, they take the house, right? Yeah. yeah. They repo the house, repossess the house. Because what else can be collateral? A car. Any assets that you have. Car, if you're getting a, a smaller loan, jewelry, um, firearms, livestock, you know, anything that you own that is of value can become the collateral. Repo. What? Is the repo. Mm -hmm. So, like, if you did not pay that loan back and you filed for bankruptcy, all that could be taken. Okay, so be careful what you put up for collateral. All right, real estate property, the borrower is obligated to pay back with a predetermined set of payments, okay? Over a period of many years, the borrower repays the loan plus interest until he or she eventually owns the property free and clear. Okay, let's look at this. Okay, so right there is the interest. Yeah, we're not going to deal with that. Segments, industry segments. Production, processing, market distribution, and sales. All right? So the main segment you think of agriculture is you think of farmers, okay? That's the production segment. That's only one part of agriculture. So the farmers are the ones producing the grain and the livestock and the other crops, producing aquaculture, producing fish, producing timber. That's the production segment. Okay, we have a processing segment that turns that raw commodity that the farmer produces into a usable product, okay? Because if I'm a pig farmer and Bailey wants bacon, are you gonna buy a pig for me to just get the bacon? Yes. No, okay, she's not. Because she's not gonna know what to do with the pig to get the bacon and then she's gonna have so much left over. So we're gonna to have to have Ethan there to be the processor, so I'm gonna send my pigs to him, he's gonna process it. He's gonna send it to Cadence, who owns the grocery store. The grocery store is going to sell Bailey the bacon. They're gonna sell Israel the pickled pig's feet. They're gonna sell Dan the pork chops, and they're gonna piece it out in every part gets used. I'm just gonna take it off for myself. Yeah, three space And then your dog gets the ears. And in agriculture marketing, so all this stuff has to be distributed, okay? When you go, like when a farmer takes their soybeans to a grain elevator, that grain elevator there is going to have a grain grader. They're going to take a sample, it's a big suction tube, goes in the, in the truck, goes, pulls it up, drops it into the commodity house, um, and where they're going to grade it. They're going to look at the test weight, so does it weigh 
and all soybeans. Does it weigh 60 pounds per bushel? Is it lighter than that? Is it heavier than that? They're going to dock your pay. So they're going to reduce the amount that you get per bushel on that. Is there wheat seeds in that? If there is, they're going to dock your pay. Okay? So there's commodity graders. That deals with quality control and marketing managers is when it comes into that grain elevator, where are they going to sell it to? Where are they going to get their most money? Guess what a grain elevator does? They, they will buy your grain that is not clean, that's a little um, too dry or too wet, doesn't weigh just right, soybeans too small, and guess what they do with it? They mix it with all the good stuff and make a grade A product and then sell it for a better cost. Okay? They have the power to do that. And then distribution, that's getting the products to the consumers. Logistics, think of UPS. It's a miracle that they ship that many packages every day and they actually end up in the right places. Within, like, think Amazon Prime, you can order something and within two to three days it can be there. Or day. Or day in some places. I don't know. Yeah, well, we have Amazon Prime yeah. and it's crazy, like we, and since COVID has been messing up, so we can put my in-laws address and they'll actually get there in a day. We put our address down, it'll get there in like a week. So, we've been playing this. Okay, agricultural sales. There's a lot of products out there that farmers and, and producers need, like seed, chemical, feed, livestock, um, equipment, all those as part of the sales segment. And here's a bunch of careers. You can see those. Okay. See them? Careers. Yeah. And that's that with the PowerPoint, the test will be Friday.